Hi, this is Kerry with Multicopter Warehouse, and this week is CES, the world's largest consumer electronics show. And we were expecting something from DJI, and we got a few things. Number one is the Osmo Mobile 2. Uh, this is a change to the original Osmo Mobile, which was very, very popular and was out at uh, originally started at $299 and then went down to $199. The new Osmo Mobile 2 is $129, so a big reduction in price. Well, why is there a reduction in price? Uh, they've simplified the system. So instead of having interchangeable batteries like uh, the original one had with the Osmo batteries, it has a much larger built-in battery up to 15 hours of runtime. So while you're not gonna spend 15 hours recording because your phone's not gonna handle it, the reason why they put such a big battery in there is so that you can charge your phone with it. Now, unfortunately with an iPhone, if you're in normal landscape mode, the port's covered. But if you're in the portrait mode or you're using a phone that has the port somewhere else, you can go from the handle into the phone to keep your phone running for longer periods of time. Now, it also includes new features for hyperlapse, which is a very popular form of content today. So if you're looking to get into a, an Osmo Mobile, something for your smartphone, just wait just a little bit and get the new Osmo Mobile 2 for, like I said, $129. So it's a fantastic bargain. It puts it at a lower price point than the cheaper models that are out there with way more features than you'll find on anything else. The second major release is the Ronin S. The Ronin S is a single handheld gimbal, kind of like an Osmo, but designed for DSLRs or mirrorless cameras. Now, this is really popular format for a gimbal today because it's a lot more portable than something like a large Ronin, Ronin M, or Ronin MX. So the Ronin S, designed for the smaller cameras, has a big battery in it. It's going to last a good long time out in the field. There's dual mount or dual handle capability is going to be available for it, remote focus, lots of cool features that are going to be in the Ronin S. Now we don't have price or timeline yet, but uh, we'll get more information as this develops and we'll be able to see more about it. The ones they're showing at CES right now are just prototypes. They're a little heavier than the final production model should be, but it looks like it's going to be a very promising new gimbal. So check these two new products out, the Osmo Mobile 2, ready to order right now here at Multicopter Warehouse 129, and stay tuned for more information on the Ronin S as we get more information. This has been Kerry with Multicopter Warehouse. Be sure and check the like button and subscribe to this channel for all the latest news, tips, and tutorials. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.